What is up? I am Eric and you are watching Resell Pickups. In this video, we head out to some thrift stores in order to find some cool stuff that we can resell. So if you like this video and you watch it all the way to the end, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell notification. That way you know when I post more videos. With that being said, let's check it out. Okay, so we are going to a few different places Two, to be exact, because I found some good stuff, I decided to put together a little bit of a video and show you guys what I found. So first off, we're gonna hit up a Goodwill and then we will go to another thrift store that is kinda like a, uh, a place where they take in goods and then they sell it and then they use the money that they make to rebuild, help rebuild houses, which is very awesome. Um, they are good with prices as well. So we're gonna check out that Goodwill first so let's head out there and then we will hit up that other thrift store as well. Okay, so you guys saw the video, you saw what I picked up. And I usually shy away from picking up hats, but you guys saw this. This is a really, really fresh Florida Gators hat. Check that out on the back, it says Gators. Honestly, this was two bucks. My anticipation is I could probably sell this for like 15 to $20, I'm hoping. Um, it is a good size, it's a men's size, which means it'll probably sell well. It's a flat bill and it looks very good. It's got that Florida, and the gator on the front, and then it's got that snapback on the back, that gator, and I'm honestly, this is a pretty sick hat. If I was a Florida Gator hat a fan, I would probably own this, but I'm not, so I'm gonna definitely flip it. Okay, so if you guys don't know, I am a gamer, I love playing games. Um, uh, I have a channel based on that, but that has nothing to do with this. However, it does whenever you pick something up that is as awesome as this. Check this out. There's nothing really on the back there, but you do see that link, that tune link uh, from Spirit Tracks. Definitely a great pickup. As you guys can see, uh, the tag is a Zelda tag from Spirit Tracks, and it was only five bucks. This long sleeve is awesome. And I wanna say I saw them for like 20 bucks. Uh, if I find good comps, I'll put them down below here and show you guys kind of what I'm thinking these things will go for. But honestly, I found this and I thought it was pretty sweet. Uh, so I definitely wanted to pick it up. So let's keep running. Okay, so here you guys saw me pick up that Adidas jacket that looks very sick. This is a size large. It does look very cool. It's got that classic Adidas look. It's got that two-tone colorway. Looks really cool. And then on the back, it's got the stripes. Uh, and that was also $4.99, which is five bucks. So I picked this up. I should be able to get about 15, 20 bucks for this thing. Uh, I'm definitely looking forward to it. Um, there was nothing wrong with it and it was cheap so I'm definitely going to pick that up to flip uh, because I think it is definitely well worth it. Okay so the last thing you guys saw from the uh, Goodwill here was some good stuff I have picked up this another jacket usually I don't find many jackets for some reason but here you go I picked up that Ralph Lauren that polo you got the polo logo that classic zip up it's got the stripes on the side this is classic jumpsuit style so I thought this was great it was only $5.99 which is probably pretty good um, I'd, I'd expect to get 20 bucks maybe a little bit more maybe 22 maybe 25 if things uh, turn out right, but I thought this looked great. It looks very stylish. It has pockets down below. 
Always check your pockets, maybe you'll find something someday. I haven't found anything great yet, but eventually I will, as the lights are straight up falling. Um, with that being said, let's uh, head over to that other thrift store and see what we can find, because Goodwill had a few things, but not too many. So let's keep rolling. Okay, so I'm kind of doing this differently because most of this stuff I found at the same time and then I uh, put it all together and showed you guys kind of what I got in the store. But honestly, um, I didn't find anything on the actual shelves like when I went to like just swipe through all the new stuff. But I found all of this in the clearance aisle, which meant it was half off from what the price tag is. So I'll show you what I got and how much it was worth and how much I paid for it. So. First off, I found this very awesome Nautica um, polo, like Hawaiian polo. You guys can see that Hawaiian, um, uh, the flowers, they look very awesome. It is a Nautica. Uh, it looks a little worn, but I think that's just because of the age of it. I don't think it's a vintage, but I think it does look cool. $4.98 for this. I think this looks awesome. I think this will sell very well. Um, and like I said, it was $4.98, which meant it was really $2.50 after um, half, taking it in half. And that's an XL, so I think this will sell well. I think that's very awesome. Next, I found a vintage tee, which is actually vintage this time, and that is this New York Mets t-shirt. Now, I think this is an XL as well, 2X, and this was only $2.00 and 98 cents on the tag. You can see that there, if it'll focus, um, which meant this was only $1.50. $1.50 vintage um, New York Mets shirt. I think this will sell for like 15 to $20, maybe a little bit more depending on how it goes. But I think retro and vintage stuff works very well and that looks very sick. Next, if you guys notice, I'm just gonna bring these all out at the same time because I plan on bundling all three of these because I think they're all the same size. Medium, medium. Oh, this one's not a medium. That's the one I didn't want to bundle. So this one is a 2X Magellan shirt. Um, it's a fly, or not fly, it's a fishing uh, shirt. It's got the vents on the back, if you guys can see that. And it was $6.98, which meant it was, what, $7? So $3.50 for this shirt. I would not have picked it up for the uh, $6.98, but I think I have another one of these uh, back here in one of the bins that is actually the same size. So my thought is I'll take both of them, take pictures, and then I'll post them together as a lot and see if I can get like 30 or 40 bucks out of it. I should be able to get a good deal for this, but for what, $3.50? Uh, this is a nice shirt and I think it is well worth it. And the two bundlers, again, Magellan shirts. These aren't the fishing ones um, with the uh, like the mesh insert. These are the adventure gear. I think both of them are. Um, yeah, and so they're kind of like a thicker material it looks like. But I got this blue one. It's not buttoned up, so whatever. Uh, and this orange one. I think these two uh, together should sell very well. Uh, they're both $6.98, which is way too much. But for $3.50, I will gladly pick up both of these and in order to uh, flip and resell them, that'll be definitely good. Bundle them up, put them up for what, 30 bucks. Uh, someone should pick these up. Uh, taking $7 to go to um, what, 30 bucks is pretty good. So I'll pick that up and be happy. So at this store, I picked up five shirts. Uh, that Nautica shirt, that awesome Nautica looking shirt, the New York Mets, those three Magellan shirts. And then I picked up a polo jacket. I picked up that Zelda Spirit, Tr Spirit Tracks uh, hoodie. 
not hoodie, uh, like, what was it? It's not a hoodie, it's a crew neck. And I got this uh, Adidas jacket, and then I picked up that Florida Gators hat. All of this stuff will be for sale on either Mercari, Poshmark, or eBay. Or if I find something else to sell it on, I will do that as well. But all of this was great deals. I think the most I spent was $5.99 on that polo jacket. Everything else was dirt cheap, so I had to pick it up. And I think you guys should do that as well. If you're out there looking and you want to find good, cheap stuff, you definitely need to head out to Goodwills or these thrift stores, especially look in their clearance section or look at when they're going to be doing sales and check those out because that is when I find the most stuff and the most well worth it stuff. So with that being said, thank you for watching. Comment down below and let me know what you picked up this week, whether it was a small hat or something grand like some uh, Air Jordans that you sold for 85 bucks like I did recently, a few weeks ago. So if you like that, check it out. Um, down below in the description, I'm gonna have my links to my both my Instagram and then all of my selling stuff. So Poshmark, eBay, um, Mercari, all that stuff will be down in the links still below. So I wanna say thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell notification because it lets you know when I post more videos. One more time, thank you so much for watching and make sure you have a good day.